What is up my lords of bagels and welcome to some Call of Duty Modern Warfare gameplay So today guys I want to talk to you all about is the rumour to do with the PS5 So ever since the Xbox One has had backwards compatibility We have been asking why hasn't the PS4 got this And yeah you could say we have got it We have the Playstation Now and we have Playstation 2 on the Playstation 4 However these are only like a select few games that the graphics have been updated on but we haven't really seen a good backwards compatibility for the PlayStation so if you have played any of the consoles from the PlayStation ranging from the PlayStation 1, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3 and even the PlayStation 4 now the PlayStation 5 will now be able to play all your childhood favorite games or even games that you kind of missed out on and you want to go and play them or even games that you just threw not threw away but just kind of put to the side and said ah oh, yeah i'll come back to that in a while so where did this rumor come from so it came from a person with the alias hip hop gamer now he tends to go to every big gaming event or be invited to private events that developers or even gaming events that are just private and he says that Sony have been working on an engine which is basically a quote-unquote remastered engine now this engine he says will let you play games from the PlayStation 1 PlayStation 2 PlayStation 3 and even the PlayStation 4 he also says that from the time the PlayStation the first PlayStation 1 was created up to now the current generation will be available on the PlayStation 5 which I can't really see them going all the way back to I actually had to look this up because I was close but I wasn't as close as I thought it was back to 1994 in Japan when the first one was created and that shit just sold straight out of the box like that was oh, I love PS1 that was just so good however Japan had exclusive games for just Japan and then of course they got ones that were all across the board for the whole world basically however will we be getting the Japanese games as well the ones that were just exclusively made for Japan or are we just going to get the ones that were made for everyone and not the Japanese ones you know it's just I wouldn't mind seeing them but probably not he also gives us an example of what he means by remastering games so it's just like an emulator that is on the PC and for anyone who works with connected devices would know about it but for people that don't basically I'll for example I'll just use a Raspberry Pi which you can find online and use the emulator online which we do in my course and we also have the physical Raspberry Pi which is pretty fun like you can code Pong onto it you can code other games onto it you can do numbers to show up letters roman numerals and many many more to do with it so hip hop gamer is basically saying that any game you have this emulator will update its graphics to your current settings on the ps5 or what i think it'll more or less do will kind of meet it halfway so i'll say okay we'll say maybe i don't know like a PS1 game it'll bring the graphics up to say 720 and then the PS5 will go down to a 720 so it'll be able to play it I'm presuming that's what they're really gonna do another thing he said was any old disc games that you have for example I have Black Ops 2 from the PS3 on disc you can actually put this into the PS5 and you can play and you can tell it will tell it will tell what generation this is from this is just mind-blowing really like it's basically going to be like saying okay ps1 right 
okay, so you want to play Ratchet and Clank, say, I, I don't, no, Ratchet and Clank, I think was PS3, just say PS3, Ratchet and Clank, okay, let's bring that up to 1080p, so the PS5 will want to go down to 1080p, that kind of shit. This guy also has a proven track record for actually getting things right. However, this is still just a rumor. This has not been confirmed yet. However, there is evidence basically stating that it will probably happen because both Sony and PlayStation have filed patents that suggest the PS5 to have the backwards compatibility. And another patent that they have is to add trophies from the PS1 to PS2 games. Now, there is already PlayStation 2, 2, PlayStation 4 games on the PlayStation Store. However, when I go to find it, I can't see it there. They might have taken it down. They might not. I'm not really sure. I don't really know. But you can get all the old school kind of favorites from the PlayStation 2. And they're basically imported to the PlayStation 4 with updated graphics and everything. And yeah, I'll try and keep you up to date with more rumors that come out and everything like that and i hope to have another video coming out soon on stuff kind of going to be randomish stuff and i'm going to try and do new series on my channel and everything like that i'm trying you know target a new audience as well but yeah that's it guys hope you like favorite and subscribe and peace